Gutzon Borglum was a sculptor famous for reviving the Egyptian and Babylonian practice of creating gigantic statues in rock as commemorations of public figures. Most notably, he was the designer and sculptor of Mount Rushmore. Sprinkled throughout the United States, his art is aimed at memorializing American achievement. Gutzon's father, James Borglum, was president of the Theosophical Lodge in Omaha, Nebraska. James had an affinity for the teachings of Helena Blavatsky and requested that his son paint a portrait of her for his personal collection. In preparation for the task, Borglum immersed himself in the teachings of Blavatsky. He then sequestered himself for a period of three days, during which time the portrait was completed. For this painting, Borglum utilized a famous photograph by Enrico Resta, known as the Sphinx. Following James's death, the painting was acquired at the behest of Annie Besant, who sought to keep the painting in the Theosophical Society. It now hangs in the Meditation Room at the National Headquarters. Throughout his life, Borglum embodied a philosophy centered on relentless improvement and the pursuit of excellence, as captured in his poignant quote. There is but one worthy ambition for us all. Do better whatever we do. No matter how capable, we must work, think, study, and do better. This alone leads to mastery, leadership, and independence. In what ways do you challenge yourself to achieve mastery?